Hey, what is up guys? In today's video we will talk about the first sneak peek from the biggest Clash Royale update ever. Super so, said, this is gonna be the biggest update ever, like the biggest changing update, gameplay changing, Clash Royale will be different, I'm so excited to show you the first sneak peek. First of all, make sure to subscribe to your channel to never miss any sneak peeks in the future, in the next couple of days there will be more, this is not the full update yet, but be prepared for that and make sure to, uh, to subscribe here and also activate notification bell because you will know every single interaction and you already know the full update here first. So I would say we're directly starting into the update information today. Everything is about level 14. Tell of you guys guessed it and tell if you guys were happy with that. And tell if you guys were complaining already about level 14. But level 14 will come. They did slash roll to prepare for level 14. We don't know exactly when the update is coming. But this is the first sneak peek. So after more than 5 years, 103 cards and trillions of battles, the time has finally come. Level 14 is finally arriving inside of Clash Royale. That's what um, Supercell told us. I swear to God, that's what he told me. <laughs> This is what Subas has said, um, 2021 and self Clash Royale of the updates was everything about player progression and they're gonna continue with the next update. Clash Royale or like Slash Royale, the current Slash Royale event was the biggest um, event ever inside of Clash Royale and helped a ton of people to upgrade their cards easier with less gold being involved into the upgrades. Um, now level 14 is arriving. So... Better cards, more damage from the cards, more HP, also tower damage health will be changed. So also level 14 tower is coming in self clash makes sense, right? Because otherwise level 14 tubes would be exceedingly uh, insanely OP. And you need to guys, you think, uh, you need to guys, you guys need to think about it. <coughs> level 15 tubes will come out as well, right? Because of the mirror. So level 15 spark sounds ridiculous. The first thing I'm gonna say, faster progression. Even after the update stops, I apologize if I'm gonna read it here, but I think it's the easiest thing for me to explain as not native um, native English speaker. Even after the update drops, we will bring down the cost, experience, gold, and cards need to upgrade to players king and cards to help lower level players level up faster. So the biggest complaint from you guys is that it's going to be pay to win. Level 14 is going to pay to win. It's so hard to upgrade cards already, but this means that it will be easier to upgrade cards from level 6, level 7, to level 8, to, from, to level 9. So cards will be still not cost the same as they like, do right now. So I think they're gonna change like a complete system. Maybe the card from level 12 to level 13, which costs it right now, um, will like the level 13 to level 14 card, like 1,000 uh, gold. Right now it's, level, it's to max the card 1,000 gold. I think it's going to be 1,000 gold still. Um, after they bring out the level 14 update um, to bring cards from level 13 to level 14, maybe just 75k from level 12 to level 13. So maybe they're gonna just put it a bit down. I think that that's my guess. Let me know what you guys think for sure about every sneak peek, every information. Um, let me know what you guys think about level 14. So the next change is going to be no time to race. Slash roll is ongoing and it will help players getting the gold and cards they need. So. Still make sure to get the full maximum of gold out of the challenges and for sure in two days the global tournament is starting where you're able to get the maximum gold. Then a question which Super says asking myself is I'm level 14, is my experience lost if I upgrade cards now? No, all the experience you have accumulated by upgrading and donating cards where being on king level 13 will be redistributed. We we die troop to you, so you're gonna get it back. This means that you could upgrade to king level 14 right when the update goes live. So in my words, in stupid English words, it means if you're currently level 13, I think that kind of the star points will get into XP. So you're always you're already able to go to level 14. This is like my explanation out of this question from Supercell, or like this question them they're asking themselves, or like which is gonna be a question which you guys will also ask yourself. So this is just my um. My think if you're level 13 right now, you were able to go to level 14 directly. Um, so I'm really interested to see how they're gonna do it. They didn't say like any specific, but this is how it's gonna be working. Basically, it's best to spend it now, people. So don't wait until the 14 is coming out. Spend it now. You will never lose anything with that. Um, yeah, here slash royal price are cheaper than they will. So yeah, Slash Royale is um, cheaper than the upgrade costs will be in the future, so make sure to use Slash Royale. Um, there will be more, they even said here, yes there is, but we have been sworn to see Q4 right now. So there will be more Clash Royale update content, but as I said, it's the first sneak peek. So make sure 
to a subscribe as I said and we will watch the video here which Supercell showed with us so I would say let's jump to the video it's a really short trailer but I'm so excited to show you guys that and here we come to a video which Supercell gave to us to talk about um, which is not really something special maybe there's some sneak peeks in there so or some more information so slash roll or no card upgrade way easier because of the gold star points the same so the great gold rush and you guys will see get ready level 14 is coming and more and this is for sure the most important factor it's not just level 14 is coming also more is coming so what do you guys think is coming to in to clash Royale? a ton of people are saying gadgets out of brawl star special abilities i'm 1 sure they're gonna bring something to level 40 i don't really think they're just gonna release um level 40 to clash war and just let it act like that maybe there's special abilities for level 14 um similar as i said to gadgets and star powers and brawl stars people are even saying they could get heroes and um, which you just get level 14 which could be an interesting fact because that means you could grind more to level 14 because right now you're grinding for level 13 that's the maximum level but you don't get anything yes you get the star points but they're not that cool so maybe like a star points rework maybe so there's so many possibilities but I want to give you now, at the end of the video, my opinion about level 14. I personally am a big fan of level 14. I know a ton of you guys were saying, yeah, it's pay to win, but I'm 1% sure Supercell gets the way around that. As I said, the prices overall will be changed, so I'm 1% sure the price will be better for you guys. Even if you're just like a lower level player, level 10, level um, player, it will be easier to upgrade and get to level 14 as it is right now. So... I just love the fact in self Clash that you can upgrade cards. This is like, this is why I played the game. Or this is why I played the game since five years. Even I couldn't upgrade cards the last couple of years. So for me, it's just a fresh experience. For the most of the max out players, it's a fresh experience. So I would say stop hating updates before they're out. I personally think it's a really great idea. I think Supercell had to do it. If not now, um, in the next couple of years. But this is my opinion. So please let me know, guys, in the comment section what you guys think about level 14. What do you guys think about the first sneak peek? And as I said, I'm just so excited. What does it mean for Clash Royale? I'm so excited for the Clash Royale future. And let's see what the next sneak peeks are going to be. I would say I'm out. Thanks for watching, guys. And... I hope you have an awesome day. Goodbye, and I'm so excited to read your comments.